with us now is our resident dog trainer, Kelly McFarlane. Welcome back, Kelly. Lovely to have you here. Good morning. Now, after your segment we did a couple of weeks ago on crate training, you had quite a bit of viewer feedback, didn't you? Yes, one of the main questions we kept receiving was how long can the actual puppy itself be in the crate for? Uh, so really, there's just a rule of thumb. Um, if it, the puppy is up to 10 weeks of age, then usually we tend to say up to an hour. Mm -hmm. um, if they are usually up to about 14 weeks of age, then they can go up to usually about three to four hours. We tend not to say any longer than that. Um, it's just too much during the day for those puppies. They've got to get outside and get to the toilet. Yes, well, don't we all? But my dog, she's a grown-up dog. She sleeps in her crate overnight. That's fine? Absolutely fine. Yeah. Good. It's a little yeah. den. She loves it. Oh. So this week we're going to be talking about mat training. I thought mat training, you've set me right, I thought mat training <laughs> was where you taught your dog to go to the toilet on the mat and you just got it closer to the door and then that was them, them toilet trained. But this is not what we're talking about at all. No, you're thinking about toilet training using um, toilet, toileting pads. Yeah. Uh, mat training is, is actually to teach a puppy to go to a specific place in the household. Um, and you can utilise that when you go to friends' houses or to the cafe because we all want the latte dog and that's yes. the lovely dog that sits next okay, to us peacefully. Do. So talk us through this video then. Uh, so the video here, we've got little Rosie and she, oh, same big Rosie I should <laughs> yeah. say. And um, so we're teaching her just to get on and off the mat. Um, each time she gets onto the mat, we reward her for that behaviour. And then gradually the aim is that at some point she's not going to want to get off the mat because every time she gets on, she's loving the fact that she's being rewarded and is doing the right thing. So what we tend to do is the more we teach them to do this, um, and as you can see now, she's not wanting to get off, so she picks it up pretty quickly. But what it's doing is teaching the puppy that's exactly where I want you to be, mm -hmm. and it's just a great visual training tool for them to use. So you're not telling her off when she gets off the mat, you're rewarding her when she gets on the mat. Yep, so she learns all the time that if she's on the mat, she'll get rewarded, all the good stuff happens there, and it's basically the best place to be. Okay. Should the mat be made of anything in particular or it doesn't matter? Um, you can use either a big towel, you can use a mat. We tend to say make sure it's bigger than the dog so that the dog can always succeed and get things right. Okay, fair enough. Oh, speaking of, Hello. have we got a mat big enough for this? <laughs> yes, Hello, Sid. He's obviously come over for a reward. <laughs> <laughs> Get his treat and off he waddles. <laughs> That's it. Oh, fancy seeing him here. <laughs> he subtly stepped in there. Mm, where could he have been? Okay, so talking about this, back, going back to the mat training, can you teach an older dog to go on a mat or do you have to do it with puppies? No, it can be taught with any age of dog. And as I say, it's a great tool to use, especially if um, you're someone who's about to have a new baby. Um, brilliant way to teach your dog where you would like them to be. Um, certainly if there's young children in the household mm -hmm. or as I say, if you want the lovely dog at the cafe to sit quietly. Well, yes, we do. We want to be there, have that good dog. Them. Like we want yeah. our children to be good. We want the dog to be good yeah. as well. <laughs> so we want to go back to our favourite cafe again. Oh, excellent. Well, that's really good. Well, let's now go, before you go, let's move to our uh, award, the Cafe Pet of the Week. Uh, there she is, Angie. That's Angie. We've got a $50 voucher from Canine Natural Dog Food coming out to your owner, Angie, and that's Katie on the shore in Auckland. Uh, and you can enter at home too. Simply upload your pet photo to our Facebook page, which is Cafe NZ. Thank you so much, Kelly. We will see you again next week with more dog training antics.